Hello, our YouTube family. Joe Hunt Fonseca with Empire V telling you to look, listen, and live with us. We're in the Woodlands, Texas today. It's a hot day. We're in the Del Webb gated subdivision. I'm gonna take you inside, show you all the amenities. One of them being this multi-purpose room designed by Empire AV Services. Truly custom. Let's go check it out. made it inside. Um, one of the things that they wanted to make sure that we brought up on this video was the amount of activities and time that everyone in the neighborhood spends together. As you can see, we have a big puzzle layout, thousand piece puzzle, um, game nights, all of the games that you can think of, board games, uh, Yahtzee, dominoes, whatever you need is in there. Let's keep touring. Let me take out what else is in here. Health is wealth. No matter what age you're in, please take care of yourself. As you can see, we have a 55 and up gated neighborhood with a full-size gym. Everything that you need, your cardio machines, your chest, your legs, everything is in here. As you can see, it's a packed house. And here we have the indoor pool. Let's go jump inside. All right, so we made it to the indoor pool. If it's hot, go out there. If it's cold, come in here. Two pools, one outdoor, one indoor. This one actually has a volleyball net. So I can only imagine the type of tournaments that happen in here. All right, so we made it to the outdoor zone. This is a full zone of audio, all powered by clipped in ceiling speakers. This TV is integrated into the system. They have full control of what this TV does, and it actually has the four sources that we spoke about earlier. They can play their cable box, they can play their Roku, they can play the PC, or they can actually merge this zone into any of the other zones. Um, we'll get in here in a bit, because they're having a meeting, but you can actually hear that they have this zone linked into the system, and they're having a full Zoom call in there. Over a hundred people, uh, which this is awesome to see, uh, because this is what the system was designed for, to give them the option to have full Zoom meetings for the entire neighborhood. All right, so here we have a Sony television and a Bose soundbar. This TV does have the option to play throughout this soundbar or merge into the speakers into the system. This is fully integrated into the control four. So this little blinker that you see right here is what controls this television. It is on the network and we do have IP control, but we always have a secondary option just in case there's any equipment or system failure. We have a second um, control option to be able to service it remotely. Um, this is on a full motion mount in this was part of the addition. We have an audio and a video balance sending video here and audio back into the system so it could be merged. This was a project that we completed within three days. Uh, first day was wiring, second day was speaker installation, four day was testing. This system was programmed and tested in the office. We put endless amount of hours into making sure that everything was gonna work. All right, so we're still experiencing some Texas heat, and I would love to be inside of this outdoor pool. Good thing about it is they also have an indoor pool. They have a lot of square footage, a lot of amenities. If you are 55 and up, and you need a place to be, or you want the place to be, this is the place to be. All right, we've made it to the tennis court. Two full-size, professional-sized tennis court that are used for their training, for their activities, and some of the tournaments. You should see it here on a Saturday. Ah, over here, this is how I get down on Saturday. I still need to get my lessons, I need to come over here. Excuse my ignorance, I do not know the name of this sport, but I can tell you that they did not get left behind. As pickleball takes over this country, they definitely have two full-size pickleball courts on that side, and then this, I don't know. If anyone can educate us and tell me what's the name of this sport, there is two full-size uh, courts here. So they definitely put a lot of thought into the amount of sports and activities that they wanted to put into this recreation center. All right, let's keep walking this amazing facility. As you can see, we're passing up the arts and crafts room. There's a full-blown casino night going on in there. I'm sure no illegal betting is going on in there, uh, but it is a game room where they can go in there and play and arts and crafts basically is what it is. Now, let me show you the group fitness room. This over here, um, as you can see here, they really focus on their health. You saw the big gym that they have over there, 
the racket courts, the tennis courts, the pickleballs, the volleyball activities, everything. They couldn't do it without a group training room. So I'm sure there's yoga, group training, Zumba, whatever, all goes in here. All right, so we've made it to the highlight of this video and why you are in here, the multi-purpose room. This was, and I want to highlight, this was a full post-construction afterthought. Everything that I'm about to show you was done after the build out, the wiring, the design, everything. Let me show you. Okay, so this is a multi-purpose room. So as you can see, it's divided into three different zones, at least in here. That's a separate zone that I'll take you out in a second. But as we work our way around this way, that's zone one, zone two, and here we have the main zone. This is one of the two dedicated video zones that has multiple inputs. I'm gonna show you how the system works because it's fully backed up by Control 4, but as you can see, one of them is Roku. That way, the Netflix, the YouTube, all of your streaming apps are controlled from one button. One of the rules that it had to be as simple as we could possibly make it, right? This is your home screen. These are your separate rooms, multi-purpose, your main one, multi-purpose two, the middle zone, three is the back zone, and then the patio. All of these have separate control, separate volumes, separate sources. As we go into this specific multi-purpose room, if I click on UVerse, you'll notice that this turns into the UVerse remote, and now the projector is switching over to the cable box. A couple things I wanna show you. It is fully integrated and controlled from the app. From here, I could change the channels of the system. This becomes the AT&T remote. From here, I can call the menu, the guide, full control of the cable box. We do have the second option, which is the Roku. Let me show you some of the other inputs. We do have a presentation mode, which is the HDMI for anybody that's coming in here to plug into the system. And then the microphone, test, test. One of the requirements here is this, that this had to be a fully integrated Zoom room. What they wanted to do was they wanted someone to be able to come into the system, start a Zoom call. I'll show you the camera in a second, which this, since it is multi-purpose, there is some things that they have to do in order to be able to uh, take advantage of some, some of the features. However, they bring the camera out, it's already pre-programmed, all they have to do is plug it up. Zoom goes up, from this mic, everyone in the room can hear me. Whoever is speaking through the system, everyone in the room will be able to hear them. And not only that, but this also becomes not the local audio, but the microphone that's built into the computer for conferencing. This took a lot of design, and as a matter of fact, I'll show you a video of Dion coming up with the entire system for this rack. In this rack, we got Control 4 Core 1, Arachnus router, network switch, audio interface, Zone Pro audio distribution, matrix switch, HDMI valence, a, net, a PC, a Roku, and 70 volt amplifiers. All right, now let me take you to the brains of the operation. This here, first of all, there is about 40 hours of work into this rack before it even made it here. All of this was designed because it is fully custom. This is a project that had a lot of uh, different features that it had to have. Um, so it took us a long time to design it, but we delivered to the T with everything that they wanted. We have wireless microphones. We have our control system. We do have a dedicated network for everything in here. That way we can actually service this system remotely. We were able to allocate static IPs for everything in the system. Here we have all of your commercial mixers. One of the awesome things here is this is actually powered by an Atlas uh, EID system. Uh, these systems are not integratable. So what we did here is fully custom, all triggers and commands uh, done by Empire AV. We got our big controller, matrix video, this piece of equipment right here. Um, it's the one that is going to allow you 
to plug in multiple sources. As you can see, they've, we've added a wireless display. We have our cable box, our Roku, um, and these things can be copied from this image to the other one. I'll show you how that works in a second. And then we have our multi-channel smart amplifiers. One of the things that I do wanna show you is the back of this rack. We think about the before, we think about the after. Uh, these systems are truly tested before we bring them in. However, it's electronics, things happen. With us uh, having an Arachnus network in here, it allows us to log in, troubleshoot. Uh, the system has been up for roughly six months and zero service calls have been made other than additional training. Um, it is a full custom system. So there is some training that had to be done. Um, this is an older uh, neighborhood. This is a 55 plus neighborhood. So we had to make sure to make it as tech simple as possible um, and we've delivered that after a couple of trainings to make sure that everybody knew what they was doing everybody is happy with the system it gets used on a daily basis um, so we have many more of this same project coming up all right so i pulled out the big camera out for this one it's not as good as the one that you're seeing me through however this is an atlona usb powered camera um, it, we do have as you can see the extender and the cables, this isn't used all the time, but it allows them to bring it out, plug it in. It does have 20X zoom and it actually has automatic tracking. So it will track you as you're in here talking. Now for simplicity purposes, we added a PC that's built into the system. We have a wireless mouse and a wireless keyboard. Uh, we wanted to keep it as simple as possible. This isn't a system that will take a genius to figure out. There's a couple of touchscreen buttons over there tell you exactly what to do and the system just does it. So very, um, this is a very important piece of equipment. It does have a dedicated PC um, to merge it. Now that I've showed you everything that's in here, let me show you how we can make the same image come through in both places. Let me show you how we separate the audio. Let's play some music and then we'll wrap up this video. All right. All right, now here, this will allow me to merge multiple zones of audio or multiple zones of video into the same thing. Um, as you can see, each of the zones now are controlled separate and are playing the same thing on this television as the television in the package. All right, so it's time to shut the system 